Hello, welcome to QBasic programming. Here we are using DOS box for executing QBasic application so that it will be executed in full screen mode and graphics mode. So first of all we have to mount our drive. Mount. So I have saved QBasic in my D direct D drive and in the folder QB45 and I have to mount it with a drive letter uh, let it be G so then I have to transfer the control to G drive so now the G drive is mapped to the QBasic folder that is QB45 so I can uh, execute QBasic.exe that is QB so the QBasic is opened so now we will try a program for an animation with the help of get and put statements. So remark animation using get and put. So we need uh, screen 7 for graphics mode screen mode any graphics mode I am using screen 7 here and we have to declare some arrays here so I am going to declare an array A of size 100 and one more array B of the same size and for animating I am drawing a circle here circle 10 comma 10 comma 5 I am drawing a small circle here maybe I can use some color also comma 4 And here I am using get to get some blank data into the array. So 50 comma 50 to us 60 comma 60 and I am keeping this value in the array B. So 50 comma 50 uh, towards 60 comma 60 there is no value that means the complete value will be 0 it is black. So all the values in the array B will be stored with zeros. and in 60 I am going to get the value for the circle which we have drawn already. comma a so this circle is plotted at 10 comma 10 means 10 minus 5 5 is the radius so the circle will start from 5 comma 5 and it will end at 15 comma 15 and it will be saved into the array a so next I can use a for loop I equal to 1 to 200 step 1 or 2 whatever we want we can give the steps and next statement I can use put command to plot the image into the screen so I have array uh, I have a loop I i plus 50 so i am going to fix a value to be plotted so it will start plotting from 50 along x axis and y axis also i am going to fix 50 if you want to change the values it's not a problem
next statement is a loop for delay for j equal to 1 to a, a little big value and next j a 90th statement we can put it again that means we can erase the circle which is moved by putting an empty circle so we have to put it in the same value which we have given above uh, that is i plus 15 comma 50 and we are using an operator and so this and operator is used to erase statement is next and and save the program uh, get get put so let us run the program and try it yeah it's working fine Actually, this program is doing. I will explain the program once again. So, two arrays are declared. One array is A and another array is B. Array is a kind of variable which can store many values. A of 100 means it can store 100 values. Normally, an array a variable can store only one value, but array can store many values depend upon the value given in the bracket. So, A is an array which can store 100 values. B is another array which also can store 100 values here we are uh, supposed to move a circle uh, so first we are drawing the circle and the radius of the circle is 5 pixels and it is plotted initially at a place 10 comma 10 and with a color 4 4 is red color and we are getting the circle with the help of the 60th uh, command in the 60th line that is get 5 comma 5 till 15 comma 15 because it is plotted as 10 comma 10 means it will be spread around 5 pixels so we have to subtract 5 pixel to get the initial value and add 5 pixel to get the final value and it is stored in A at the same time we are copying some values from the empty place where it is completely black and it is stored in the array B so we found we can see that 50 comma 50 till 60 comma 60 nothing is there or if you want some other value you can choose the value but you have to make sure that no graphics is plotted in this particular area. So we have some value in B that is completely empty or blank and we have some value in A that is exactly the value required for this circle. So it is stored in A and here we are using a for loop for i equal to 1 to 200 step 1 and in the loop we are putting the circle in a position initially we are putting in a position 16 comma 15 i's value is 1 1 plus 15 16 comma 15 and the value in a is plotted there and after a delay this for loop is used to give a delay after a relay we are putting the empty array that means all the values are set zero and we are giving an operator and and operator and operator is used here because when both the values are different that will be nullified so if you don't use the and operator it won't work properly we have to use the and operator to clear it and next let us run it and see the program once again. Okay, thank you for watching this video. Try this program by yourself and if you have any queries, please feel free to ask me. Bye.